All right, this morning we are joined by Oklahoma City Mayor David Holt for our Thursday chats. Good morning, Mr. Mayor. Hi, good morning. I want to start with this. Uh, obviously, the Memorial Marathon and the Arts Festival, they're back this weekend. Big weekend in Oklahoma City. First, I want to ask you how you're feeling about having it sort of back to normal. But before that, you mentioned Tuesday that you're planning on running in the kids' race. So we're wondering if you're warmed up and how you plan on winning. Have you stretched yet? <laughs> <laughs> I'd be embarrassed to tell you how much trouble I seem to have running a mile and <laughs> two tenths, but yeah, I'll, I'll do my best, and uh, it'll be a struggle to keep up uh, with my kids. But uh, yeah, this, as you said, this this is a week that we kind of got accustomed to for you know ten or twenty years. Everything sort of came together where you had the marathon and you had the arts festival and, and you had the solemn commemoration of, of the, of April 19th. And it just always converged for this huge, this huge week in April. And if you were lucky, you got some Thunder playoff games in there too. And then of course, what happened, you know, we all know over the last couple of years and, and believe it or not, I mean, it's been three full years since we have been able to, experience this this convergence uh, again and so we are so excited this is really kind of one of the biggest signs of normality to me that we finally have the marathon back in april uh and we've got uh you know the the arts festival back in april neither of these things have occurred together in april in three whole years so yeah it's an exciting week again and and i'm i'm anxious to see it all play out and, and i know our residents are going to have a lot of fun we had another moving uh, ceremony this week, the Remembrance Ceremony, marking the 27th anniversary of the Murrah Building bombing. And this year, we had the French ambassador to the U.S. who spoke during that ceremony. What was that like having him here? You know, well, this was a reminder of the global reach of this event. And it still, you know, uh, the way that we responded to the bombing still inspires others. And in France, they had a terror attack. A few years ago, they are working on a memorial. They are working on honoring those that they lost, and and that is why this connection developed. And so, uh, the French ambassador had been meeting with uh, folks from our memorial here in Oklahoma City, and ultimately that evolved into an invitation for him to come and join us. So this was actually the first time uh, that the French ambassador to the United States had been in Oklahoma City. I don't know. I mean this one. I mean all French ambassadors for the last 130 years. There'd never been one who came to Oklahoma City. So uh, that was uh, nice to have that opportunity. Uh, we actually went to dinner Monday night at Gray Sweater, and then uh, he gave a wonderful speech Tuesday morning. And it was uh, it was nice to share that fellowship. Obviously, our connection is one based on pain mm -hmm. and loss, but nevertheless, it's a real connection, and uh, those are the things that bind us together as humans. And I think. It's really important to remember our shared humanity uh, when we talk about the bombing because it was ultimately the result of dehumanization and our continued response ever since has been to try to find the basic humanity uh, in all of us. It was another very powerful and moving mm -hmm. ceremony Tuesday. Mr. Mayor, we're glad that you're with us this morning. Thanks for talking to us. Absolutely. Thank you. Have a great day and everybody enjoy the Arts Festival and the Marathon this weekend. Thank oh, you.